Good morning, guys, and happy Father's Day. I'm just coming outside to get our towels. I've got laundry in the go, and I left our towels out last night. And, and now this is happening. It is pouring rain, pouring rain. And it almost smells like fish out here because it's so humid, so humid. It's like the, the lake is right on top of us. So yeah, it's scorching outside, but it's raining, so I don't know what we're gonna be doing today. Sam and Sophie are at the grocery store. Whenever go Sophie goes to the grocery store with Sam, you can be sure that we're gonna be getting some super fun, yummy food because she always finds it. She always gets treats whenever she, she goes. Cause yeah, she always can talk dad into getting anything. All right, tell them about your Father's Day gift. So, um, I, um, have one Father's Day gift and a prank gift. A gay gift, right? Yeah. Just wait. Let's just see if he notices. Yeah, so basically Gabby came to me the other day and she's like, hmm, I want to do a gay gift on Dad for Father's Day. I wanted to do like a prank gift for Dad on Father's Day. So I got my box um, and um, grabbed one of his things, which is this blue tie. So this is Dad's tie that he already owns, yes. right? And I put it in there. Let's get some tissue paper. I have tissue paper we can put in there. Okay. And, and then... We're going to see what he says. Yeah. Uh-oh. We're going to see if he says, isn't this my tie? Or if he says, wow, thank you. I always wanted a blue tie. So you guys are going to get to see too. Yes. Right? Is he a liar or... <laughs> Is he a dummy? Because he didn't realize. <laughs> liar or a dummy or grateful? Yeah. Okay, so then you also picked out this for him. This. She also bought him... She also bought him a lottery card. Put it on the very bottom. She also bought him a lottery card because she's... She, he loves that kind of stuff. A lottery ticket. It's a scratch ticket. He loves it. Hey, get out of there. He uh, loves that stuff, and so she actually said to me yesterday, hey, I really want to get this for Dad. Guys, check out my craft room. It's still a bit messy, but not as messy as it has been in the past. I'm sort of maintaining. All right, where's my tissue paper? Do you want to use... <gasps> oh my gosh, I keep overflowing the sink. Did you turn it off? Look. This is all I have, yeah. but that's cool. Look. Oh my gosh. I keep doing this, but literally I keep getting saved by the bell because somebody comes along. Look, my phone's sitting right there. Somebody always comes along and hears it at the last second. Scary. Oh, and it's hot. Uh-oh. Hot. Okay, let's let just pretend it. that never happened. All right, so you wrap up your present really quick before they get home, and it'll be so funny. Level 15. Look at the new one I got. So pretty, and it's going a lot faster than it is on camera. And it's spinning. Don't just sit there and poop. That's what you do. All right, see, level 15 just got there. Now I have 15 fidget spinners. Yay. Sam and Sophie are home from oh, shopping nice. and we are going to do our presents now. So, Dad, are you ready? Happy Father's Day. I don't even think I said that yet. Okay. You are Thanks. I'm ready. All right. So, who's going first? Okay. This is from Gabby. It won't shake. Make a noise. Not. No. All right. Let's see what it is. This is all her own. She picked everything out herself. Oh. Wow. Do you love it? A blue tie. Did you need a blue tie? I could always use a tie. <laughs> she how wasn't do, sure. How do you wear it? No, around your wear, neck. Do I ever wear a tie? Uh, yeah, but, it's around my neck. but you know what her favorite color is? Yeah, it's blue. Yeah, so that's why she picked that one. Awesome. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> What? She wasn't sure. She wasn't sure. I love it too. Let's win this. Yeah. Can I scratch it? <laughs> yeah, you're lucky. You're so, lucky. one question. Do you have other ties that are similar? I don't know. Do I? <laughs> yes! That's your tie! I took it from your closet! <laughs> you stole it from my closet. <laughs> I gave it to you. 
<laughs> we wanted to see. We wanted to see if Dad was dumb or okay. if he was, or if he was smart. Grateful. Or uh, grateful. Too. Or grateful. Like we he was about. so grateful and so dumb, a little dumb. <laughs> Sorry. Not so much you know why we were talking. It was a, a prank, a Father's Day prank, okay. and you failed. <laughs> Good job, sister. I was being nice. I knew it was my you time. did not. <laughs> Okay, but the the lottery ticket she picked herself. Well, I wonder if it's already scratched. I'm gonna check. check. Maybe it's a prank one. Oh no! Maybe it's a prank one where you know the ones you buy online where you scratch it and it always comes when out you're a winner. Mom, when you were paying, when I went with mom, you picked it out. Yeah. Okay, and Sophie picked out her present all herself too. All her right. Dad knows is what it, it is. From my closet. Is it, from is it my dirty underwear? <laughs> mm -mm. Alright, am I clean No! Oh, my favorite chocolate. Dad's favorite thing. I know who wants to split it with me. Me! Aw, you're gonna share? Me! Only two. If I win you money, will she? She gave you... Yeah, if she wins oh. you money, you better buy her own chocolate oh, bar. Yeah. I will. Alright. Here's his other Dad. present. He's similar to me. All right, this is what I need because when we go camping, I won't have a broken chair to sit on. Yep. Two of our chairs broke last year, so Dad needed two new chairs for camping. Awesome. Thank you. Like they match. Father's Day prank gone right. That was super cool. Never in my wildest dreams that ever think Sam was ever gonna fall for that because he never falls for anything and he totally fell for her. I can't even believe it. Gabby was giggling in the background and I was like sh trying to kick her, like, trying to block her. He's like, what? Okay, let's scratch this ticket. The girls and I are hanging out in our favorite bookstore and look what we found. New fidget spinners. Nice, huh? Sophie's over there looking at the Schleich stuff. Yeah, the bunny coop. Rabbit coop. Yep. Mom, these are both so cute. Yeah, we should collect all the farm stuff. Look at this one. Do we have this one? Uh-uh. Get him again. Sophie already has him. Sophia has him. He's cute. They don't have very many horses, though. This is their I whole really want this. entire Schleich stand. So, um. We have the chicken coop. No, this is the rabbit coop. Oh, that's the rabbit hutch. Let's yeah, see. see. Oh, so we at, have this one. Look at. Oh, it's adorable. Do we have rabbits? I know we have at least one. I have that rabbit. And the other one. Yes, we, we have two rabbits? Oh, I love it, you guys. What are you doing? Are you setting up to play with all the Schleich here on the train table? Yeah, that's what I like to do. Even a total. Even the turtle. So instead of playing train, you're gonna play farm at the train farmyard at the train station. That's super fun. Horses on the loose. Horses on the loose. Farm animals. Farm oh, land. Farm. Be a boy, I can see oh, Sophie. And this is a baby. Sophie. Anyway, they have the super coolest toys at this bookstore. Whoa. At this bookstore, I need to look and see if I can find some more curriculum for this year because I have a ton of stuff for Sophie, but nothing for Gabby. And I think I'm in the wrong spot. Guys, we are at Chapters, and there's a Starbucks affiliated with this, and it's right beside us. And a lady just came over with a big tray of strawberry frappuccinos and asked us if we wanted to have a sample. And we said, yeah. Is it I good? really want it. Do you like I it? Really want it? You want one too? But look at how big these are. They're tiny, but they're cute. Save the cups, because I love them. Everyone has to give a little cup to me. For Schleich. That's what we can do. Really, she thinks of everything in relation to horses. We let Sam go off and do his own thing because it's Father's Day and he wanted to not come to the bookstore and we wanted to. Now the girls are gone. Anyway, I'm looking at books that I want to get for the first time ever. Get off! And the girls are fighting get over off. here. Look, Sophie, Gabby, sit on the fireplace. Go pretty. No, thanks. I'm looking at Philippa Gregory. I love her books. When we got home from shopping, my middle son Kyle and his wife Kathleen were here. I didn't vlog them because they don't really feel comfortable being on the vlog. But anyway, they came and they brought Sam an uh, awesome Father's Day present. Sam's two favorite things. Can, can you guys tell me what they are? Two favorite things. Chocolate and coffee. Right? Yep, he's making some of his new coffee right now. 
So this is the chocolate bar. It's Belgian extra this. dark chocolate. Doesn't it look good? It's ginormous. Seriously, I'm jealous oh, that I can't eat it. The problem is, is that I decided that every Sunday I'm gonna have a small little tiny treat because I deserve a treat, right? I can't just go cold turkey and I already had it. I had that little tiny mini um, strawberry frappuccino. So I can't have any of his chocolate. Lucky for him. Hi guys, I'm making sugar slime. So let's get on with the video. My ingredients are face masks, shaving cream, water, and I have three cups of them, and sugar. You use sugar as the activator. I need, I also need a spoon and a bowl. Now I'm gonna put the shaving cream in. I'm gonna make it, I just need to add a little bit more. More. I'm gonna stir it up. Make it all nice. Tastes like whipped cream. I want it to be in my slime. This is more than enough, so I'm good. Face the mask. Woo! Oh. Face the mask. Mask. Has this ever happened to you where you just walk outside your house and you find somebody else's clothes? I have no idea who this is. It's like a little shawl, but it has sleeves in it. Yeah, it's just sitting out here on my porch. So it's either Kathleen who was just here or it's Jesse's next girlfriend. So, but I don't know. I cut the grass today for Father's Day so you don't have to do it. I cooked my own supper for Father's Day. Oh, that's a joke. Sam doesn't cut the grass. Mmm, burgers. They look fabulous. That's good. That's for sure. Yum. My mouth is watering. Don't they look good? Typically we go out for supper on Father's Day but because some people are trying to be healthy. I didn't want to do it. Did you want to go out? Do you feel bad that you didn't go out for supper? Nope. And usually we have cake. Do you feel bad you didn't have cake? Nope. He did feel bad yeah, we didn't chocolate. have cake. But Kyle and Kathleen brought him a nice big chocolate bar, so that's good. Anyway, I want to show you guys the solar blanket that we got at the yard sale yesterday. So this is it. Pretty cool. There's a couple of spots that it doesn't cover because it's a rectangle and our pool is round. But it is working. Hopefully it's working. I don't know. People make it seem like it's magic. My friend always says, oh, my pool is 86 and ours is always like 72. So we put it on. It's been on for 24 hours. And the pool is 76. It was 70 yesterday. So it went up six degrees so that's pretty good so maybe by tomorrow if the sun comes out maybe it takes two days maybe it'll be 86 tomorrow that'll be so fun extreme sports Ugh. don't break the bed <laughs> extreme sports <laughs> that's crazy Abby the horse girl suggested that at the end of every single video we should answer somebody's questions and I said that if we have a question on the, at the end by the end of every day then we will definitely do that because it was super fun yesterday the question of the day today is from Lara Laura MVB and she asked do you still have your rats 
Do we still have our rats? No. no. So basically what happened is that the girls have been having allergic reaction. It started out really slow. At first it was just a scratch on their skin and then they would get welts and get itchy. And then it started to progress and now it is at the stage where it's affecting their breathing. So my sister is allergic to her rats. She had rats when she was young and the exact same pattern happened. What happened was that it started out really slow and eventually she can't even walk into a house with rats now that's how allergic she is and it stops her from breathing and we did not want to get that far with our with our girls health so it was really unfortunate and it was really sad for us because they were our babies they were our babies we've had them since they were small newborn babies we picked them out from their litter when they were born when they were just a couple of days old and it was really hard we rehomed them we found a little girl the same age as our girls that was dying to have them and so we've heard that they've settled in we've had emails back from them and they love their new home and they have a bigger better cage now so we rehomed them and it was sad <laughs> it was horrible and they're laughing for some other reason not because we got rid of our baby rats um. so um, it's been already over a week that we rehomed them and literally I still make a plate of treats for them every single day to give to them it's just it's it's just hard but I need to we no, need to that's good about rats is because um they'll play it up <laughs> yes and any extra food left over from parties that you guys hate yeah they you eat just anything give them to the rats yeah. unless it's citrus yeah, so that's what happened to our rats, and thank you, Laura, so for asking us that question. So if you guys have a question and you want to know something, definitely let it ask us and put it in the comments below, and maybe Thumbs we'll down. pick your Thumbs question up. to answer tomorrow on the vlog. Thumbs up. Also, Thumbs we up. have a question for you before we end the vlog. We have a, what kind of socks do you guys wear when you go horseback riding? Gabby likes to wear high socks. So no, we like to I don't like to wear high socks. I like to wear, like, um, ankle socks. Oh, okay. So my yeah, girls I have like holes in them. Like, the girls wear ankle socks, but don't you want those really high socks that are boot socks or no, something? No, because they don't have to because I have half chaps. Okay, she has half they chaps. They hold your pants. Okay, so this question still stands. What do you guys wear on your feet when you're for socks when you're riding? Short and, socks. And another question um is um I want to know what does half chaps do? Like, what do they help you do? Yeah, like what are they for? Why do you need them? Her writing teacher wanted her to wear them before, right? All right, thank you guys for watching. See you tomorrow. Bye, smile more. <laughs> Bye. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.